Okay, tell us about the pride, please, Tommy. Well, yeah, it's it's just very special. I think um, just the act of putting on like the t-shirt or the hoodie and you know wearing Great Britain clothes is um, it's been a. I, I guess a lot of people would say like you never expected it because it wasn't in golf until five years ago now. But for the last two three years, I've um, like pictured being an Olympian. I've wanted to be an Olympian and go and compete for the gold medal and. Um, like it's a very, very special feeling it is. Justin enjoyed it and brought back the gold, didn't he? So what have you learned from Justin in conversations you had with him? How proud he was, how much passion he, he came back with having winning the having won the gold medal. Um like I say, you know, nobody sort of knew golf has always had its four majors, it's had the Ryder Cup, it's had its you know, it's you know, the pinnacle of golf has been those events and then the Olympics came along and I think I guess at first nobody was sure like what it, what it what it would mean and i think what justin brought was like we realized how much it could mean to someone in winning the gold medal and how proud he was and being close to him i got to experience that um you know firsthand from him and talk to him about it so um yeah i would love to do the same like watching his face like whenever he spoke about it was like really really special and um yeah, I'm going to go with all the same feelings and hopefully come back with the same feelings. The Olympic experience is an experience that is expansive, isn't it? You get a chance to meet other athletes, but you don't quite know what you're going into yet, do you? No. Um, what we do know is we're going to the Olympic Games and we're going to compete for Great Britain and we're going to try and win the gold medal. That's what, that's what we do know. Um, you know, whatever the experience is aside from that, we don't know, but I'll go and embrace it, whatever it is. And um, for a lifetime now, I'll... You know, I'll have been an Olympian. Um, and like I say, hopefully I'll be a, a gold medalist at that. Um, growing up, you know, before your time, I remember Carl Lewis, Dave Thompson. Always, you watch, you watch sports yeah. that maybe you don't watch all the time, and all of a sudden, you, and all of a sudden, you get caught up in 100%. it. What's your memories? What's, what, what memories do you have as a lad coming through? Um, I just, I just think like if I would come home from school, or if I were even being older, you know, I, like turning the Olympics on, whatever it was on BBC or whatever it was on, and watching a sport that I knew nothing about I didn't know the rules I didn't know how anybody was going to win but I was like glued to it like cheering for Great Britain because somebody from Great Britain was there and they had a chance of winning a gold medal silver medal bronze medal whatever it was but you support the nation and you just get gripped on so many different sports by by watching the Olympics and it, it's so much bigger than golf it really really is and um like those are my memories of it and um like yeah excited to be a part of it it's a great picture of you now, isn't it? And this, this, this outfit. <laughs> Seriously, it's a magnificent. Like, you're, yeah, you're, I make so it, you're, I make you're it Olympian. Work. I make no, you it make work, it. Yeah. No, but you're Olympian. It's, yeah, you're going to go to Olympic Games, yeah, and I you've know. got the uniform, and it, you hopefully go to the opening ceremony, the closing ceremony. It's going to be. Well, I mean, you should never like underestimate like how amazing these moments are, and you should always like you know I've said you know I've played in a final group of an Open, trying to win an Open. I've you know walked down final laws of a US Open trying to win a major played in the Ryder Cup been on a winning team in the Ryder Cup now an Olympian and I think you, you can always get so caught up in trying to improve and not being happy with whatever result you've got on any given day or week and you you know a lot of the times you don't stop to realise you know that you are actually accumulating some great things and um, yeah for me like I say forever, you know, forever now Tommy Fleetwood will have been an Olympian, and, and that's something that's very, very cool, and hopefully I can come back with a medal. Yeah, you carry it off for you, so you look good, it's fine. Yeah, you, I make you, it look good. You, of course you do. <laughs> Thank you so much. No Thank